what we have here is the image timcolor.psd from the exercise files. So far, I have selected Tim's figure with the quick selection tool. What I wanted to show you here is that once we have a selection, we get the option to refine our edge, which shows up on the control bar under the main menu. When we click on the Refine Edge button, we get a dialog window which allows us to manipulate our selection parameters so we can finesse the selection further. Depending on the colors in your image, you may want to view your selection against white or black or any of these other options, but I will leave mine showing against white. You can check the Smart Radius option and adjust the radius around your selection edges, in which this operation will try to detect the edges of your selected image. You can adjust the smoothing of your selection edges, the feathering, I will actually move this one back to zero because I don't like the feathered look, the contrast of the edges, and you can also adjust the slider to the left to shift your edges inwards into your selection area or spread it out by sliding this handle to the right. With all of these adjustments, you want to keep an eye on how your edges get updated and what makes for a better selection than what you already got from your original operation. Additionally, you can check on the option to decontaminate colors and you can adjust the intensity of this option so you can eliminate any colors that got picked up from the surroundings of your selection. Once you're happy with your adjustments, you can click on this drop-down list to choose whether this operation will give you the resulting selection as a new layer, or a new document, or a new layer with a layer mask. Now that we know what a layer mask does, we can guess that it will give us our selection without getting rid of the rest of the image on this layer, but it will instead hide it. So I will choose this option and click OK. Our original layer got hidden and now we're looking at a layer containing our updated selection and a layer mask hiding what we eliminated, which we can see on the thumbnail represented in black color.